Hello viewers, thank you for clicking on the link to open this video presentation. This is not my usual presentation on a health subject, but this is about myself that I wish you share and celebrate with me. The Governor of New South Wales invited me, Her Excellency the Honourable Margaret Beasley, ACQC, for the investiture ceremony on the 12th May this year to the government house in Sydney to be presented and receive the symbol of the award order of Australia medal which I was awarded on Australia Day on the 26th January this year. It was the most exciting moment of my life and a milestone for the Sri Lankan government to recognize my work for, for done for our Sri Lankan community and medicine and received this recognition award. Hard work is a prison sentence, only if it does not have meaning. Once it does, it becomes the kind of thing that makes you, you grab your wife around her waist and dance a jig, said Malcolm Gladwell. Once again, please have a moment to share with me. Thank you and bye for now. Dr. Harold Gunatalaki. Dr. Gunatalaki is the Australian diplomat for the International Society of Aesthetic Plastic Surgery and a former board member. He is a former medical practitioner at Sutherland Hospital and creator of drharold.com. Life member of Sri Lanka's College of Surgeons, Dr. Gunatalaki is a fellow of the International College of Surgeons and the UK's Royal College of Surgeons, a corresponding fellow of the American Academy of Cosmetic Surgery and a member of the Australian Society of Plastic Surgeons and Singapore's Academy of Medicine. Dr. Gunatalaki helped establish and was treasurer for the Sinhalese Cultural Forum of New South Wales and is a former president of the Sri Lanka Association of New South Wales. He is a health writer and leading webmaster of Auslanka.com and author of Diabetes, Problems and Answers. For service to medicine and to the Sri Lanka community of New South Wales, Dr. Harold Gunatalaki. Well, you've undoubtedly gathered that uh, my form of action is all in words, uh, but I used to say when I would uh, teach advocacy to young lawyers, you only need to say the good things once. You don't need to keep repeating them. So can I say, at this time, once again, thank you. Thank you to absolutely every individual, every recipient. You have done just such marvellous work. You make our community a great community, a strong community, and you make everybody within the community feel so valued. There is only one expression which can sum all of that up, and that is thank you to each of you. Can I say, let's applaud once again.